of that out there. I know it, it looks rather small, but that's all greens. Georgia Creole collards and mustard greens. And that's kind of a tree. <laughs> the pear tree is in the way. But you can see way out there, that's our last row of okra. See those flowers? It's still producing out there. The okra is the only thing from summer that's left. And that plot only has that row of okra. Last year we had a couple volunteer um, mustard greens and Creole collards come up um, under the peach tree. So this year we were like, okay, peach tree. It's almost like the straw bale uh, planting because you basically drop a seed in grass clippings that, you know, we use instead of mulch around the trees in the wintertime. And we deliberately planted in rock. And you can see all this green. Can you see all the green coming up in the rocks? It's more of these. And then these are still underneath the trees. Check that guy out. Ooh, he's the Mac Daddy. He's a big one. And he's just growing out of rock. the leaves are just getting those disgusting spots on them and then we have beans on them then I've got a tote that I cover up occasionally to protect from the frost and then I've got the special stuff in number 67 and it's basically a flipped over tote with the bag like that. I'm actually doing a video on this little cheapy greenhouse and seeing what the difference is. Time to eat. <laughs> 